Welcome to Whiteboard Wednesdays. My name is Gopi Krishnamurthy. I'm from the IP group. Today I'll be talking about Gen 4. Uh, Gen 4 was a precursor, uh, was based on uh, Gen 1. This was 2.5 gigabits per second, and Gen, Gen 2 was 5 gigabits per second. Gen 3 was 8 gigabits per second, and Gen 4 now is 16 gigabits per second. As you can see, every generation, the throughput has doubled. Uh, and what, what I'm trying to talk to, to you today is how we implement the Gen 4 uh, in our IP. So there are two basic pipe interface widths that we support in our IP. One is a 16-bit pipe interface, and the other one is a 32-bit pipe interface. So in a 16-bit pipe interface, uh, Let's say we go Gen 4 by 16. So you'll have 256 bits of data that is given to the user interface. So in a 256 bits of data, the sm two small TLPs can uh, come simultaneously. Because two small TLPs can come simultaneously, all our processing steps have to decode all these two TLPs simultaneously and process it and also write to the memory uh, so that the performance is maintained. So if you, if you take a 32-bit pipe interface design, this will become 512 bits. Uh, because it becomes 512 bits, now you could possibly get four TLPs simultaneously, or four DLPs. So because you're getting four TLPs or DLPs, you need to process them, uh, four of them. So the amount of logic that is needed to implement a 32-bit design uh, becomes large. So the only reason people want to do 32-bit is because when you're doing Gen 4, this will run at 1 gigahertz, and this will run at 500 megahertz. Uh, so the only motivation to go to 32-bit design in a Gen 4 by 16 implementation is that you are running slower. Uh, but there is design complexity of processing four TLPs simultaneously. So, uh, so we have decided to implement the 16-bit running at 1 gigahertz with a 256-bit data path as the most efficient uh, a way to uh, keep the same performance that we provided with Gen 1, Gen 2, and Gen 3, which was approximately 95% of the possible theoretical, possible uh, throughput that we can achieve. So uh, this is our architecture for Gen 4 by 16. Uh, if you need to know more about our Gen 4 implementation, uh, please visit ip.cadence.com. Thank you.